Seven Hills in Tallahassee, the state capital of Florida. Please welcome what has not only become known as America's band, but also one of the most exciting marching bands in the world. Please welcome the incomparable, magnificent, fabulous, fantastic, and famous Florida A&M University Marching Band. 70 years of excellence in this band it's been something that's changed my life. It's a unique experience in both life and the college life of growing up and coming into maturity because for 70 years, that's almost like, I don't know, five or six times as long as I've been alive for that experience that I've been passed on from generation to generation and reached me is truly an honor and a blessing. Of course, the tradition of the March 100 is something that's exceptional with all the innovative techniques, outstanding musicianship that's been garnered over the years, uh, most of which by the legendary Lindsey Sargent, who's the uh, outstanding arranger of the incomparable March 100 and allows us to have the type of sound that we project to all of the audiences near and far. And of course, we're very proud to celebrate this year, 70 years and beyond, and of course, the overall concept of that is noting that Dr. Foster, of course, starting this group, had a vision for the incomparable March 100, and now, 70 years later and beyond, we're still carrying on the torch of excellence through our character, our academics, our leadership, our marching, and our dedication. We've been practicing for about maybe two weeks now. We started on the show last Thursday. I should say, no, the Thursday before that, so maybe two, three weeks. Yeah, it's Thursday and we still got maybe three, four more rehearsals. So we're celebrating 70 years. So uh, we're trying to take everything from those great 70 years and just try to compose them all in one show. All right, good. We'll see everybody tomorrow. You've done a good job. Let's hit the lights in five minutes. Uh, drum majors, let's get in. Get your studies, everybody. Being in the March 100 has just been an ultimate experience within itself. Um, being a leader for one has taught me to be humble and has taught me to just take everything in stride and learn from all my mistakes and everything that comes about in life. Uh, this band has given me so much more than I ever thought it would do. So Dr. Foster, yes, was the founder of the world famous March 100. Um, and to this band, to me personally, I feel like he is a true leader. With Maestro William P. Foster, conductor, please enjoy the super popular hit by Mr. Keith Sweat, entitled "Make It Last Forever." Yes, if it wasn't for his leadership, if it wasn't for his patience, if it wasn't for his creativity, his tenacity, his dedication, his perseverance through everything that came about being a black man wanting to direct the band, this probably wouldn't be here. years is just something beautiful um, and especially with this band knowing that Dr. Foster had this vision starting with only about 16 you know working instruments um, and building it into the the name the brand the staple that it is today and knowing that I'm a part of that legacy means the world to me 